Hello everyone. In this video, I will perform quality of service. As you can see, I have prepared one topology where I have a boss office and his employee's office. Now, as a network management team, we have been instructed to dedicate a specific bandwidth to the boss so that he doesn't face any traffic issue on his network. To do that, we need to create class and policy maps and set our service policies. As you see the topology, I've got a network management team where I've got two routers. Then I have a boss office which with one router and employee office with other router. And I've got some PCs for the employees. Along with that, I've got one Wi-Fi router, one server and one ISP. Well, in the configuration, we won't be using any ISP configuration or server configuration or wireless configuration. These devices are just connected to show you a wireless uh, and a office scenario. Okay. Now I have already configured IP addresses on all the routers along with the routing protocol. Here I'm using EIGRP as my routing protocol. We will verify all the IP addresses and routing protocol before proceeding for quality of service configuration. So I'll start with boss PC. I've got network of 20 and 10 here. Let's check. I'll use show commands to check, verify all the configuration. I can see loopbacks. Alright, it seems EHRP is configured. Let's check this one. This looks good. Let me check routing table. Alright, this looks fine. Already getting agency messages. Okay. Alright, let me try to ping one of the PCs. Let me, I'll go to my PC and try to ping the laptop. And the IP address is dot two right. And here the server has dot two five four. All right. Connectivity here looks good. Oh, let me check the route uh, server as well. Okay, this looks good as well. As we are connected now, I will start QoS configurations on router 1 and router 2. So this is router 1 and this is router 2. So let's start with router 1.
this is my class map match boss so this name will remain same everywhere i have to use same spelling and same name for everywhere whenever i will be using this class map and as you can see we have already moved to the map now policy now this is for precedence precedence i am using here 5 class match boss which comes from class map now i have to set my precedence now these are the numbers which i can use from 0 to 7 so we have critical flash flash override immediate internet network priority or routine so 0176 these are different types of uh, precedence i'll be using 5 making it critical so my traffic will be going this way so I need to take this interface Now let's go to router 2. Now here we have made a class map match boss precedence 5. So what's our precedence match precedence and that is 5. Now policy map. Boss priority. And I am dedicating 20% of the bandwidth so I will write here 20 my class now I need to tell how much bandwidth percentage I am dedicating
so this is all we need to configure for quality of service configuration uh, we can verify the quality service commands by running show commands let's go on router one and check let's check our policy so it shows our policy map it shows our class and it shows the precedence which we have given now let's check policy map on the interface All right. So again, QS setup. Precedence is five. It is marking its packets also. Eighty-three packets. It has already marked. And if we see the class map, class map by default, it is again mapping all the packets which are going to boss office. Right. Let's check our percentage bandwidth. So for that, we need to go on router two just run the command policy map show policy map on the interface now here fa0 slash 0 if you see here it is showing us bandwidth 20 percent so this is how we dedicate a specific bandwidth to one area or one network right so this is the bandwidth how it has been showing 20 percent strictly for boss so this is strict priority and it also received match precedence because of the class map class map is here match boss precedence right so this is simple qs configuration i hope you understand it let me know in the comment section thanks for watching goodbye